Hello and welcome to the series of knowledge exclusively designed for aspiring civil and structural engineers. If you are a fresher civil engineer or someone who is still in college in diploma, BB Tech or MEM Tech and wondering that what are the topics that you should be familiar with in order to enter into the core technical civil engineering field, then this particular series designed exclusively for freshers or entry level civil engineers would be very helpful to give you insights about many general topics and technical topics which you should be familiar with in order to start your career in the core civil engineering and this particular series is also followed by many live webinars which are in-depth technical webinars conducted by our founder and managing director Sandeep Pingle who himself is a passionate civil engineer. To get access to these live webinars, stay tuned to this channel. So let's get started with today's topic. So today's topic is workability. Please also note it is also a interview question. So what is workability in construction and management field? In construction techniques and management, workability refers to the ease and ability of a construction material such as concrete or mortar to be mixed, placed and finished with the desired properties and results. Workability is an important property of construction material because it affects the quality, efficiency and cost of construction. Materials with poor workability can lead to difficulties during mixing and placement, resulting in poor quality construction work and increased labor cost. The workability of a material depends on several factors, including the amount of water in the mixture, the size and shape of the aggregate, the temperature and humidity of the environment, and the type and amount of admixtures used. To measure the workability of a construction material, various tests can be conducted, such as the slum test for concrete or the flow table test for mortar. These tests measure the consistency and flow of the material and provide an indication of its workability. So achieving the desired workability of a construction material requires careful planning, selection of appropriate materials and proper mixing and placement techniques. A well-designed mixture with optimal workability can result in a higher quality, more efficient and cost-effective construction process. If you are applying for a site engineer job position, then this can be a very commonly asked question. So what is workability? Remember that. So in this video, Video, I have just covered the basic definition to give you little bit idea about these things but there is much more to it. To learn all these things in depth in detail in our live webinar stay tuned to this channel. Our founder and managing director who is also a passionate civil engineer is going to cover many more technical topics in the upcoming live technical webinar series. So stay tuned to this channel for these live series of technical knowledge. I hope this video was useful for you and stay tuned for in-depth technical webinars. Thank you very much.